Albert, you're the best. You are the best. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. You are actually a legend. A legend! Yes! A step ahead of Cataclysm. That's what I'm talking about. On the last roll. Just in time to get owned by Nine Fairy. Nine Frost. Uh-oh. Eight Witchcraft versus Nine Frost. Pray. I've been score witchcrafting this whole time. Oh. Well, it was only a matter of time until we faced Nine Fairy or Nine Frost. My Rise did so much damage, but the Nine Frost just one-shot my Fiora and Morgana. You were lucky to be fifth. No, I definitely had the fourth best board. It, it's just like I couldn't save any HP, so I, I went fifth instead of uh, fourth. Three portal spats. He's like only playing half the portal units. Considering how well that game started, we should be really happy that we got fifth. That game was like actually right about to be in eighth place. Did you watch the Valorant Champions yesterday? I did, it was sick. Uh, I don't follow the pro scene of Valorant very much, but the team that lost, they made like an almost sick comeback. And then this one Giga Chad, oh man. It was like, the score was like 11 to five and the game was basically over on, it was like match five, final round for a million dollars, final map. The team that was winning was up 11 to five and then randomly uh, the losing team, I think they were European, just like they clutch out four rounds in a row in dominating fashion. And then this absolute Giga Chad, Chinese guy just like kills everybody. Uh, he like pushes with a guardian on jet and then head taps four people. And then the crowd goes crazy. And then in the final round, he holds it down and then clutches it out. It was, it was actually sick. I really like watching Valorant. I'll probably watch it more. I really want to be good at Valorant. Anyway, I'm gonna play the ad break. I'll see you guys in a bit. Oh, but let's take a look at our trade in our golden first. Done for a wild game. Chrono Sugarcraft Portal. Oh, wow. Okay. That's actually really good. Uh... I can either play for the 10 portal or I can play for the sugar craft. Both are really strong. And then Chrono can just be like a, you throw in a, a zillion. All right, maybe it's my turn to play 10 portal. Wait, I got portal and sugar. <laughs> I demand tribute. Hunter, Blaster, Blaster, Honey, Frost, Pyro, Honey, Hunter. Lots of Hunters and Blasters. Eldritch, Preserver, Honey, Hunter, Blaster. What the fuck? I'm seeing so many repeats. Blaster, Bastion, Arcana. That one's pretty good. Vanguard, Scholar, Bastion. Okay, I'm like uncontested on Portal. It's actually really sick. And Sugar. I'm uncontested Sugar. Eldritch Crest. I almost want to take it and YOLO reforge it, but uh, Transfiguration and Sugarcraft is really good. Okay, Transfiguration. Definitely solid here. Oh, it's a shame it's Eldritch Crest. If it was Portal or Sugar, I just would win. But yeah, Transfiguration is super good if I'm playing... Um... Yeah, it's super good if I'm playing around uh, Sugarcraft, and it's like decent if I play around Portal. Thank God I won that coin flip, so I can make ten. Okay, I'm gonna try to slam items that can work on both builds, Portal and Sugar. Who wants a piece of this? Yeah, slam items that can work on both. Is there any way I can fit in Chrono? If you play Sugarcraft, you can throw in the Zillion for Chrono. If you play Portal, I think you can throw in Vex for Chrono. So I'll just like see which one the game gives me first. I'm uncontested on both, which is a huge high roll. This is so funny. This guy's got five emblems. Please go 10 portal. I want to see nukes. I mean, if I go six sugarcraft, you'll you'll see a giant cake. A huge cake. Like, really long and girthy cake. That's kind of sick too, right? I'll play whatever the game gives me. Both options are, are equally viable. Well, okay. Sugarcraft is playable even if I don't hit the spat. Portal is mostly only viable if I hit the spat. Maybe I, I int this round so I can get a spat, honestly. If I int this, get spat, that's just that's easy 10 portal.
I have to sell Jace if I lose. I think I'm down. Like, you just have to int one round. I'm already on a loose streak anyway. Yeah, I, I think I'm down to int. I didn't int last time, and I really regretted it for not hitting the spat. Mm, can we kill, like, two units? Kill the Kassadin. Oh, wait. Did I loot? Did I win anyway? Oh my god, I won anyway. Oh wait, did I? I think I won. No, please. Please, please kill me. Please. Ash, I'm counting on- Yes. What? I lost the tiebreaker? If there's a spat, I'm gonna cry. Okay, no spat. No spat. It's all good. Yeah, the fact that I like lost by one, it was like perfect, but then I lost that 50-50 tiebreaker against him. Oh my god, that would, and then if I lost that for that, I would just, I would just quit right there. Money. I lend my aid. Oh, money. I might have to sell one Soraka. This is going to be a very interesting game, like actually. Portal and Sugarcraft. Okay, I mean, I'm just gonna play both, and then see which one I get a crest for. Portal is the much more likely first place, but you can still get first with Sugarcraft if you have so many components. Uh, since I have Transfiguration, I probably want to roll for Charm a lot. I think this augment's secretly OP. For every three charms you purchase, gain another component, up to four. Because I think, in general, rolling for Charm is a good play. Okay, I'm probably not gonna sell for Econ here. Probably just, uh, I have 38 gold. It's all good. Like really need a bard. Do I beat this guy? I don't think so. I'm also worried about, would I beat this guy randomly? Okay. Okay, he's wants to do something crazy. Like, psycho, like, cuckoo! What if I pre-leveled and hit a 4 cost? Would that be, would that be sick? Alright, I'm down. Pre-level for any four cost. Oh yeah. Cast it in the four cost. Alright guys, what are the odds of naturaling a Rise or Gwen? Like right now. Or a Golden Orb into a Spat? Golden Orb? Oh, Jinx. Nice. That's four sugar. Oh, rumble. Oh, and a dupe is really nice. Yes, that was a banana. Who you calling little? Alright, I got four sugar. I'm in a pretty solid spot. Uh, if I end up playing around Gwen, then these Shiv Morellos can go on Bard. If I end up playing around uh, Portal, it just goes on Rise. Alright, pause champ! It's the moment of truth! This augment determines everything. Sugar or Portal. I can't wait. Or a Silver augment. Level up like a psychopath. Roll like twice and see if you hit something crazy. All part of the plan, I guess I I can't wait. Suffering is magic. 
I like <laughs> Okay, I think I'm most likely playing, uh, Sugar. Yeah. Yeah, I think I'm most likely playing Sugar. I'm one going away, I have got a, I've got a random Katarina too, who actually fits in really well here. Okay, I'm gonna sell this Zoe. Sorry guys. Oh fuck, do I win this? I hope I do, I need to make 20. I really need one Gwen and then this becomes like really playable. Oh no. Ah, the Jinx popped off too hard. Dang it. Okay, I leveled up, rolled and lost. That Jinx was kind of crazy. Wait, if I get the Spat or the Gwen, I mean, honestly, at this point, no, at this point, you can't play Portal. It has to be Gwen. It has to be Gwen. I'm sorry, guys. I would love to go Portal from this spot, or in general, for 10 Portal, but I'm literally one going away from, like, the perfect board. Sorry, guys. I can still get first place with this and build a cool board. Trust me. Random smolder. Is there a way I can play smolder? He, he is blaster, but I don't think he actually does anything with items. Ah, oh, it's such a shame that the second portal, or there was a spat on the second one. After, it was like two rounds after I sold all my portals. Okay, well at least I'm completely uncontested. So I can just like go roll on eight. Katarina can hold fewer items. Uh, what units do I want now? Amelia would actually work out really well. I mean, early six sugar crap should be a first, right? Couldn't you use the, the spat and use it for sugar craft emblem? I mean, I don't have the sugar craft emblem right now, and Gwen is the perfect unit for my build. It's six sugar craft and warrior. Taking anything else is throwing the game, I promise you. Like, yes, you could have done it, but it requires a big high roll. Like, there's no way I'm passing up on a free Gwen right there when I already have five sugar craft and one warrior. Alright, sack one, level to eight, roll for two star four costs. Or more like one star four costs. I'm sitting on three pairs of like mid tier units. I might roll a tiny bit, just like get a charm. Uh, definitely down to roll once for charm right now. Oh shit. Uh, I should actually just level right now. Okay, focus. Who wants a piece of this? I can't wait. I never hold back. Hmm, I feel a blizzard coming. I am only as wild as magic.
Okay, was well, just mirror did that suck? I didn't really hit anything. I got like one Fiora, I guess. I think I have to take this. Need the money. units am I looking for here? Watch this. Yeah, what, what units am I even looking for here? Um, right now I'm just playing Emilio. I guess he gives me Scholar. I definitely need to play this for Khan because he used Chrono Chrono Preserver. I think it might just be a Rakan over Emilio, and that's it. I don't think I'm supposed to sell that Katarina yet. Katarina was Fairy, and then uh, Preserver. I guess I just want a Morgana. But I, I gotta keep rolling for charms here. No, not that charm. Marvelous. Did Emilio do anything that round? I feel like... Yes, he did. But yeah, I, I can't drop the Zillion. He, he makes perfect use of the Chrono, so he's like really efficient. But I gotta just keep rolling for Charm, and then just roll for Gwen. I've got Item Collector. Gotta slam as many items as I can. Man, that enemy shop was so sad. I can't believe I hit like one Fiora, zero Gwens. I wasn't exactly sure what unit I wanted, but. I didn't, I definitely didn't hit any of the units I needed. Uh, I already have a Shiv and a Morellos. I think Adaptive makes a lot of sense here. I'm completely uncontested. Like, surely I just hit my two stars, right? Can't go nine without at least like a two star Gwen. Wait, am I stupid? Oh my god, I, I literally took the wrong component by accident. Oh my god, I, I took the wrong half. <laughs> Give me a Gwen. Oh my god. I can probably find a use for the cloak, but wow, I, I seriously can't believe I did that. Go finish him off, Bard. Nice. Do you want Arcana Brazilian? No, Chrono's worth. Chrono's really good. It's a lot of heals. I feel a blizzard coming. Okay, wait. Time flies like an arrow. Fruit flies like banana. Come on. Why is it so hard to hit? I'm uncontested. No one's playing Fior or... No one's playing Fior or Gwen. And they're like the only units that matter right now. This is actually very frustrating. I don't know what to do. I can't play the game. 
I've rolled like 80 gold on eight, uncontested. I also still can't believe I took the wrong half of uh, adaptive. That's actually so bad. Oh, game gave me the right half of the adaptive at least. Thank you, game. All right, come on, Albert. This guy has five duplicators. It's completely uncontested. Not a single Gwen or Fiora. Please let me hit. I have every other upgrade. Well, besides the Morgana. But like after I hit those, I can actually go nine. Oh, double adaptive. That actually works out. Now we're cooking. The old magic may ne'er be quenched. Are we best friends now? Come on, one Gwen. I'm begging you. I'm on my knees. One Gwen. One Gwen. Oh, thank you. My items worked out really well. Yeah. Uh, I just gotta roll for charm every round. I'm really strong. Definitely not making it to nine. If I could go nine and then play uh, like Rakan, it's pretty nice. Just by every single charm. Okay, Gwen's got a crown guard, so she can be in the in the front. I'm not sure exactly how I want to position. I should know that Gwen wants to be in the front to get crown guard value. Uh, Fjord doesn't want to get targeted first. Morgana in the middle. And then backline, I guess, can just be spread out so you don't get killed for it clumping. Bard should be behind Gwen, because he's got the shiv. Wow, Morgana's like, I noticed you needed Econ. Nice. That guy had five dupes. I feel like Hoi is not strong enough that you can win with uh, Hoi 3 if you have to dupe for it. All right, roll for charm. Okay. Something like that. No, I'm on the wrong side. I feel like I win though. He, yeah, he's got zap attack and featherweights, but I, I think six sugar craft with like transfiguration max value with item collector. Like the item collector is crazy here, by the way, because I'm like two full com or uh, two and a half full items above everybody else. So like, item collector is already pretty good, and I have like ultra value on it. Bye bye. All right, top four. Uh, who needs an item? <laughs> Portal crust. Uh. I could do Blaster Fiora. It's like really random, but I, I think it's actually even Shroud. There was also a Lost Whisper available. Oh, whoa. There was also a Lost Whisper, but I actually like the even Shroud variant a little bit more. All right, uh, roll for Charm. Yeah, I like Even Shroud. Even Shroud and Last Whisper both sunder people. Uh, Last Whisper sunders who you're near or who you target. Uh, this one sunders everybody nearby, and it makes you like a little bit tankier. I feel like Fiora has an issue with dying too quickly. How many stacks am I getting per round? One thirty-two. So, uh, I'm not gonna make it in time.
Oh, wait. Wait, if I'm getting 132 per round. Wow, wait. How are you? I feel like this is a really optimal Sugarcraft game. How am I not, like, able to uh, hit? Moral is on Morg. Uh, I think it's better on Bard. What's the max one? It's, it's at 2200. Oh, fuck. I think I just ended my Fiora. Fiora, please don't get one shot. Okay, thank you. Wait, Jinx might carry this. Oh! Oh, it's really close. Dang, if, if I had my Jinx in the corner, actually, like right here, I actually would have won. If, if she was just targeted last. Alright, uh, not too bad. Just got a level. Wait, how did I hit 2200 in previous games? I've done it like twice. I feel like this was about ideal, as ideal as you get. Trainer Golem, Sugarcraft, Transfiguration for components. I have like hella items. But, like, I'm definitely not going to hit 2200 here. Uh, I know I have a Morello's, but I think I need more anti-heal. I think Bard isn't a reliable uh, Morello's user, so let's let's have two. Okay, positioning like almost doesn't really matter here. I feel like you just like let your units go crazy. Oh, is this nine frost? Wait, my team just exploded. Was that 9 Frost? It's 9 Frost. Uh... Okay, wait. Just go for Gwen 3. I don't know. Ah, goodbye world. <laughs> okay, yeah, if it's 9 Frost, I'm definitely dead. I, I need the big cake or a Gwen 3. Oh, I actually sold a couple of Gwens. I feel like I might have been able to go for it. Yeah, man's got three Frost emblems. Okay, honestly, not bad. Oh, I shouldn't have sold the Gwens. I, I didn't realize. If, if I was, like, more alert, I would have realized he had 9 Frost, and I would have held every single Gwen in preparation. Like, I didn't know I was getting a dupe. I don't play Sugarcraft enough. But, like, now that I think about it, you are guaranteed a dupe there. So it's something I could have realistically planned for. I, I could have actually intentionally went for a Gwen 3. I definitely saw, like, 7 that game. But, like, I sold them for Econ, because I was like, oh, let me go 9 and just, like, play to 2 star everything. I mean, it's totally fine. This It happens. We only really lost 10 LP for that mistake, and we weren't guaranteed Gwen 3 anyway. How did this man hit three Frost Spats? He had one on his target dummy, and then he naturaled two Spats without getting a Frost Crust? Where did you natural two Spats? Oh, I, I think he took I think he took the one that I passed up on because I couldn't play 10 Portal. But where did you get the other one? He must have gotten like a charm. Oh, no, no, no. There was a gold orb. I got 12 gold from it, which was fine. Uh, He probably got a Spat. Eh, I mean, not bad. Pretty good game.